Hey guys, it's Luna and welcome back to another video and if you guys can't already tell by the title of this video or this cute little guy in my hands, today's video is going to be about our new foster kid in Garfield. Today's video is going to be all about how I feed, stimulate, and just take care of Garfield. But before I start this video, I'd like to give a big shout out to my friend Rocio for watching my videos. Let's get started. Bye! First, I'd like to show you where I keep Garfield. In my room, I have a playpen. And inside of it, it has a nice blanket and a plushie. That's about what are you doing, mister? Are you trying to escape? has a plushie that has a heart in it. So when I turn it on, it beeps like a heart and it's supposed to be his mama. So that's where I keep Garfield. Bye! <laughs> As you guys can already tell, my bathroom has literally turned into a kid and nursery. This is where I keep the cottons, this is where I feed him. And there he is, let's go feed him. Okay, so first thing I'm going to show you is how I stimulate him. Over here in this jar, I keep these cottings for him. And while I'm opening it, I just put him here where he's nice and safe, where he can't fall. I grab a cotton. And I just go ahead and rub his little booty like this. And then he will start to pee. Right now he's meowing because he's very hungry. But you have to stimulate him before so that he can have a room in his tummy. Yeah, he's a lot of pee. So now what we're gonna do is get his little bottle that was sitting in warm water and we're just gonna feed him. So because he's very hungry, he will eat a lot. There you go. He's a hungry boy. Now, in order to make this um, formula for him, you have to put one, one, part, one part powder and two parts hot water so that it can be nice and warm for him. And look, he just drank so much. So, you want any more? No, you don't? Well, I guess that's done feeding him. Let's see. And sometimes he eats so much that I have to make another bottle for him. It also makes a very big mess in my bathroom. My bathroom is literally not a bathroom anymore. It's a kid in this arena. So he's not hungry anymore. So that's how I feed him. And now I'm just going to put him over here while I'm going to go ahead and get this so that I can go ahead and clean the mess because he made a mess with lots of formula. And now, as you guys can see, his little face is all dirty. So I'm just gonna get a little piece of cotton, just a little piece. And I'm just gonna go ahead and clean his little face. So he's not dirty. Oh, don't fall there, you little boy. And let's see if he wants any more just in case. Yeah, he wants more guys. He's a trickster. He said he didn't want any more. He is a he's um according to his teeth, um he's supposed to be three weeks old according to my calculation because in his mouth he only has incisors. But those are not for eating meat yet, so we can't wean him yet. If you look in his little mouth, when he meows, he has little teeth. So now that he tricked me, I'm going to just stimulate him again, before and after. And once you put him back inside of the house, you always want to give him a little keypad. Oh, he's doing poo. You always want to put him back inside of the house with a nice heat pad so that he's all nice and warm. And he 
just did number two. What a good boy. He hasn't really done poop in one day. So, there we go. It's coming, and this is disgusting, so I'm not gonna show you guys. Like, very disgusting. He has lots of poop, actually. <laughs> Ew, it went on my hands! Ew! <laughs> Garfield, you're, you're such a weird boy. Why did you poop all over me? Oh my god, I'm gonna have to cut this off of the video, aren't I, Garfield? This poor little butt. And we're just gonna throw that away because that is very, very disgusting. Ew. Ew. <laughs> okay, now I'm just gonna clean that poop out of there. Don't want poop in my sink. That is disgusting. Ew. <laughs> it's okay. It's just poop. It's okay, Garfield, right? Everyone goes poop. So, yeah. And now I'm just gonna wash my hands because I just literally got poop all over my hands. Now, because he went poop, I'm gonna have to get this cotton and clean his butt. Because we don't want him putting poop all over the place. Look how dirty his butt is. So, so how you do this butt bath is you get warm water, really warm. Make sure it's not cold because that will make them sick. And you just rub their little butt. Don't get their head wet, only their butt and their like lower belly. And then, after he should be all nice and clean. Perfect. Now he's all nice and clean. What a good boy. So, now I'm just going to go get a keypad so that he's all nice and warm. My cat did so much poop and he got it all over my sink. So when this happens, we want to keep it safe for our other cats, Ollie and Ginger. And we're just gonna go ahead and clean it up. And I'm just gonna do a time lapse of that because this bathroom is so dirty with poop. So, bye. because he got poop everywhere. But after he eats all his food and his tummy is all nice and full, Garfield will go and take a nap with his little mommy. So let's go show that video. So what I'm gonna do is just gonna go and do this, open it up. So he's right here sleeping next to his I'm just gonna leave him in there so he can go back to sleep. Cause right now he's had a nice little poopy. So let's just go put him back in. So this is what I do so he can go to sleep. I move the mama. I grab this blanket. And there's a heating pad in here so he's all nice and warm. And I just sort of like wrap him up in there and then I put the mama on top of him. And then I close it. You guys saw there? And then he just goes to sleep. He's a nice little boy. So I wanted this video to be it's almost like a little update about our pets. And here's Peach's bed. So as you guys can see, he's still in his little his little tank. And he made a really big mess with his food. Tonight today I gave him some food and that's like he made a big mess. So over here he has lots of bedding so he can um Dig, and then in here he is right there sleeping like or after I took Garfield and Peaches oh oh you're just gonna snatch it aren't you 
You're such a weird boy. Huh? Are you being camera shy today? Oh, okay, never mind. You're coming out. So, as you guys can see, Peaches is doing super good. He just makes a really big mess with his food. He's a little naughty boy. And he just lets me grab him. Super cute. There you go, Peaches. So now let's go show you Oliver and Mamsie. All right, Bye. guys, here's Ginger. As you can see, she's gotten very big. She's such a cute girl. So I'm in a different room because I don't want her to be next to Garfield because you never know if he has some sort of sickness. Oh my God, what a mean kitty. So yeah, once she gets mad, you don't want to pet her anymore or else you'll get scratched. But yeah, right now she's being a mean, little meanie. Oh my gosh, she attacked the phone! Oh my god. But yeah. She keeps attacking me even if I'm not even touching her. But yeah. So that's Mamsie. She's a little meanie girl. Okay guys, so here I have Ollie. And as you can see, by the way I'm holding him and by the way he's just acting, he's the nicest kitty ever. His favorite is belly rubs and he just loves them so much. He's like a little baby. He will literally just lay on you. He's just a little baby. He is so cute and he just like knows what to do in our house now. So he's so cute. I love him. Come here, Archie. Well, there's Oliver. Guys, I hope you like this video. Right now, Garfield is sleeping. And Peaches is sleeping, Mom and Alchie are just running around like crazy kitties. So, I hope you like this video. Stay safe and we'll see you next time. Bye! Okay guys, so here's Ginger as you can see. She's gotten... She's a bad girl.